with the Yo-Ho-Ho, -Ho, it's Tale of the Toaster. It's part 27, but finally, I think that in this episode we're going to truly end chapter 2 and begin chapter 3. I'm heading in this direction. There's another save block. I, it's like a few seconds into the video, but sure, why not? Let's... Ugh, this looks scary. Hmm? Okay, the screen <laughs> everything going down. Pardon me, sir. Would you happen to be Mario? How do you do, sir? Mario Master wishes to see you. If you would, please call on us at the mansion on the far side of Forever Forest. My master would also like me to add that she has in her possession important news regarding the Star Spirits. Well, that says it all, doesn't it? Better go. Please make haste. We shall await your arrival with a warm welcome. Please just give me a- <laughs> Okay, I wasn't actually that surprised, but that was quite shocking. Ah, oh, finally this Let's Play have some, has some blind moments. Chapter 3 begins. The Invincible Tubber Blubber. <laughs> All right. <laughs> that was a bit surprising. What, invisible wall? Oh, it's right. I see now. Oh, it really is like alternate pathways. Thought I would have had enough of that with the desert. I guess I better get used to know. Yeah, get used to. I can't even speak properly now. Did you notice that grass over there rustling? I swear I saw it move. Yeah, I think. No, I'll keep Goombario out a bit longer so I can tackle the new enemies, but after a while I'll probably have to switch back. I'm going in a complete circle here. <laughs> yeah, I'll have to uh, switch in a moment. I'm going to keep going this way uh, so that I have a more effective enemy for fighting these things. Yeah, I've heard that Chapter 3 is when this game really starts to pick up, but this area isn't impressing me so far just because I don't like mazes and branching pathways oh well yeah if you get the path wrong in this area it apparently sends you back to the beginning which I've done twice already this is basically just like Fuji Forest from the Inazuma 11 series ding 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 I finally talked about Inazuma 11 outside of my Mario Tennis Let's Play I should actually fight one of these uh, yeah but I'm very happy about that now because they recently announced that the new games are going to come to Europe on June the 13th and you should all buy them! Uh, dun, 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 dun. Oh, is it? yes! I can one-hit KO these things. That's going to make things a lot simpler, so let's just waste this turn tackling it. Well, not waste, but... This is a piranha plant! Piranha plants pop out of the ground at unexpected moments, so be on your guard! Max HP 5! Five. Well, the other one had it died after four. You've seen him in every one of your adventures, so I imagine you know him pretty well. Yeah, they're even going to be in Mario Kart 8. Your sharp jaws point upwards, so you'll have to get bitten if you try to jump on them. They smile after biting people. That smug smile. It makes me hopping mad! <coughs> oh, and it makes me hopping, coughing, I don't know. Right. So, 5 HP it claims to have, so am I going to want to KO with this? Oh, I get it. It's because I had the first strike. That's why. Right, so, Goombario's just going to get eaten here, right? Yep, so, that says everything I need to switch into Cooper or Vomit. Probably go with Cooper. Give him a chance. So, uh, dun, 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 dun. I know that just a quick little slam of the hammer would be enough to just beat those things, but I always feel like I have to get the perfect timing every time, just in case there's some kind of bonus for getting lots of perfect timings. That's a complete guess, but I think they had that sort of thing in Mario RPG. Yeah, you level up. Now, that sort of thing in Mario RPG, The Legend of the Seven Stars, and the Mario and Luigi series. So, might as well, am I... Did I go down that one? I can't remember now because I spent too long in that battle. Uh, 
Alright, we've come full circle now. Can I go down one here? Oh. That's it. Oh, change while I remember. Cooper. Now. Maybe this maybe the flowers just is like go down here. <laughs> I can English today. Yep, that was the way to go. Mm, what do you think you're doing? This is Forever Forest. Path ahead of here is extremely dangerous. Didn't you know that? We'd better go back. Is it because you're going to be the danger and fight me? Okay, so that's your story. You're invited to Boo's Mansion. You may pass then. Uh, Alright, listen carefully. If you want to get through this forest, you have to pay really close attention to your surroundings. If you choose the wrong paths, you'll end up back at the forest edge before you know it. Will I go all the way back to the start or just the start of this area? I don't know. I hope it's the latter. The areas around the correct paths will always look slightly different from the others. Watch carefully for clues. For example, in this area, take a good look at the inner trees as you walk around. In one of them, you'll spot strange glowing eyes. The exit near that tree is the path you want to take. These clues will be different in other parts of the forest. Watch the inner forest very, very carefully as you go. Might even find diamond dust at the end. Okay, so yeah, this might not be so bad if there's a clear visual hint for each successful pathway. Fuzzies are green now! Fuzzies are green now! And I think I need to bring back Tackle again. But, I mean, it's Tackle? This is not Majora's Mask. This is Paper Mario! You got the platform right, at least. Okay, Goombario. Because I'm going to have to tackle these things. I need to relearn the timing for that. Refamiliarize myself with it. Yeah, and then I can make myself immune to damage. Garage, garage, damage, damage. I don't know why there's a difference, but let's go. Tattle, forest fuzzy. This is a forest fuzzy, forest fuzzies are over here. I'm not going to break out into that song, it's just not going to work. 6 HP just for a little fuzzy. That's not very positive. Oh, they suck up your own health and they divide. Oh, they sound awful already. I'm scared. I might actually... I think it's time I actually tried out one of these power-ups while I've got them. Um... Charge! I know that doesn't do damage on this turn, but now I'll be able to one-hit KO it. Of course, I wouldn't need to, because now I'm going for a head bonk. Yeah, basically that was a waste of a turn, but I needed to try my new ability out. Because I think that's the badge I'm going to replace once I find a badge that I'm proper into, you know? dun 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 I mean, I know that there's supposed to be some kind of long spin badge for sale in Toad Town, but when I went to Toad Town, I didn't see any kind of badge which was supposed to extend the duration of your spin. Maybe it was a star piece reward, but I didn't check, so... Oh, well, never mind, but... Yeah, I do want that star spin... Not star spin, this isn't Mario Galaxy. This time you got the platform wrong. But yeah, I do want that badge, but I couldn't find it, so I left. Right, so I guess the the inner hints are going to get more different each time. Well, that's looking pretty different, so through I go. Please help me be correct. Was I? Was that right? I think so. Ooh, yeah. You know what? I'm actually going to use charge this time in a productive way because now I'll be able to one hit KO everything. Brain power! Head bonk! See, they've all got 6 HP, so now I do just about enough to one hit KO them. I'm, I'm speaking with the right timing, I'm not pressing the A button with the right timing. 
Yeah. Slaughter everything! <laughs> Forest Buzzy! Headbunker! Headbunker! That headbunk's gonna be totally inconsequential because I could have won. It KO'd it with Mario anyway. I should have used that turn to switch back into a different partner, but oh well. Head but this isn't a headbunk, that's the hammer. Oh, the charge only applies for one turn. So it was a waste! Flip's sake! <laughs> oh, yeah, I'm definitely getting rid of that badge once I find a suitable replacement. I'm getting low on health. I should do something about that. I don't... I have a few regular mushrooms lying around. I might as well use them because they're going to be pretty much redundant soon anyway. Uh, change member, Cooper! Because Goombario can't do damage on this turn anyway. Yeah, 11 hit points. I'm going to have to do something about that. I don't know how far away Boo Mansion's going to be. I can't promise that I'm going to make it there in this episode, but I hope I will. I hope it's not too far away. I think from this point onwards I'm going to be avoiding battles because I'm in a bit of... A bad situation in terms of health, but items, let's just use all, you can't use them in the overworld, seriously? Oh dear. I think that was an audio cue. I think that was an audio cue. Ah, oh, there, I saw it on the face. Gosh, I would have gone straight past that if I wasn't paying attention to the audio for once. What's that over there? Piranha plant? I'll just ignore it. Oh my lord, I'm getting right on out of here. <laughs> Run away from a plant because you can do that quite easily. Oh my, take your money back Mario. What are you throwing that for? It's just a plant. You don't have to throw your money for that plant. Yeah, they're flat, so not that hard to dodge them. I don't see some kind of hint yet. Oh. So, is this going to be it? I see no hint, but I see coins, so I should be collecting them. Right, I'll ignore that. I'm going to come full circle now, aren't I? Maybe the thing is to do with piranha plants. I guess it's time to go. Time to start paying more attention to the piranha plants because yeah, I must have come full circle now. Oh, I'm not taking on four at once. Just leave me alone. Ugh, I'm gonna have to guess if I don't figure it out soon. No, I'm gonna figure it out surely. Hint, hint, hint. This one doesn't have a piranha plant near it. But that might be because I killed it earlier. I think that's the... Okay, it does have a piranha plant near it. So that idea of a hint is out of the window. Watch that be the correct one and I'm going to run away from it once again. Because I'm just going to keep going around and around. Because we love roundabouts. <laughs> I slipped that in there. Uh, go around. Will Goombario give me any sort of assistance in this area? Is it just my imagination or is it getting darker? Are we going the right... Don't say that! Don't say that! Uh, is it something to do with the mushrooms? Ah! Okay, so it's to do with the mushrooms. Mm. I'm making this a nightmare for myself in editing. Right, that's four mushrooms there. Was the other one only two? Ah! Yep, I'm right editing. This is gonna suck. Okay, now that was... Oh. Okay. It's Blackpool. <laughs> I can continue. What now, game? You figured out your tricks? Maybe. Ah, they're deflating and dying. Or am I going backwards? Don't tell me I'm going backwards. Oh, if I'm going backwards, that's gonna be... Oh, 
all wanna cry. I'm sick of battles now, I'm just gonna run from all of them. I just wanna think about this area. It's just too much for me. Well, they're doing something different to the dying ones, but does that mean that the other one was correct and I'm going backwards? I need to stop asking questions. Right, are they gonna... They're gonna die as well, alright, so... That makes this pair the odd one out. So I'll go forward. Maybe I am going the right way after all. Just tell me already. Okay, the flowers are good. Oh, I suppose I can take this thing on its own. Uh, no, I don't want to. <laughs> this is an RPG and I'm just running away from battles and my commentary is referencing nothing other than running away from battles. No. Phew, I thought... Ah! I thought I was back at the very start. For the fun of it, I'm going to read Goombario's thing. He's confused. You are joking. You are absolutely joking. Maybe I would have taken the time to fight this thing if I had Cooper with me, but I'm not going to bother to change him up now. Please, just let me go to the mansion now. There, I'm done with that silly forest. And I can heal and save. So, if you ask me honestly, I think this has been a bit of a boring episode, but I can't turn down the opportunity to end it once I make it to the save block. We made it, Mario! We got out of the forest! So now I know that if I ever play through this game again, I've got to reach this area with a different partner for different dialogue. It's about time! Say, don't you think that's the mansion the old Boo was talking about? Probably is. I can let myself in, yes? Of course I can. Alright, so I'm going to heal myself up good and proper and talk to the guest. Oh, hello you. Welcome, sirs and madam. Madam? <laughs> I'm pleased you made it through a forever forest. My master awaits you in the room highest up in this lovely mansion. Ah, uh, that's quite big. I suppose it's only three floors tall, though. Please go to the third floor. There you will hear all the news of the star spirits. I'll see you there. <laughs> You know, after having done that whole forest section, maybe the entirety of Chapter 3 just takes place inside this mansion. I wouldn't be so bad with that. A nice short chapter to help me feel like I'm actually making progress. I've only just started Chapter 3 and it's already Episode 27 of the Let's Play. But in the next one, it will be Episode 28. So, TTFN, ta-ta for now. Oh, I can't wait to edit this one.